Gemini meteor shower of 2019. NASA says go out tonight for the meteor show. Gemini's 2019, the best meteor shower of the year, welcomed last night by the U.S. Space Agency, but it's still going on. The Geminis are expected to peak after slowly building intensity since the start of the month. Gemini meteors arrive every year around mid-December and casting as many as 120 shooting stars into the night each hour. The meteors are the result of the Earth passing through the littered orbit of the asteroid 3200 Phaethon and bits and pieces of spark raw space rock are uh, broken off from that asteroid, slam into our planet, and uh, incredible speeds are reached by these. According to NASA, the meteors appear to stream towards Earth from the constellation Gemini, and hence their name, the Geminids. They're typically best seen between midnight and 4 a.m. every year, and the sweet spot is around 2 o'clock in the morning. Unfortunately, this year's viewing will be hindered by the presence of the bright, waning gibbous moon. The, night, the moon will be about 92% illuminated, which threatens to wash out the night sky. William Byron from MSFC Meteorite Environment Office says you should still go out outside, see the Geminids tonight, because they will be beautiful. He says, with the holidays right around the corner, most of us are in gift-giving mood, and one of our favorite gifts every December is the Gemini meteor shower. Brian added that under dark clear skies, the Geminis can produce up to 120 meteors per hour. But this year, the bright, nearly full moon will hinder observations of this. Observers can hope to see up to 30 meteors per hour because of the moonlight. Weather permitting, your best chance of catching the Gemini will be around 2 a.m. local time, they will appear to be radiant, radiate from a point in through the high sky near the constellation Gemini. The radiant is a point in the sky from which the meteor showers emerge, and they higher the higher it is, the more meteors, of course, are expected. Geminis typically favor the northern hemisphere, but are still visible south of the equator as well. Brian said that as the night progresses, the Gemini rate will increase. If you see a meteor, try to trace it backwards. If you end up in the constellation Gemini, there's a good chance you've seen the Geminid. The Geminis, Geminids are observed in the Northern Hemisphere, but no matter where you are in the world, except Antarctica, some Geminids will be visible. Meteor showers, best seen in pitch dark darkness, of course, under a clear sky and with unobstructed view of the horizon. So remember to give your eyes anywhere up to 30 minutes to adjust to the darkness and dress appropriately for the weather if you're outside. Brian said avoid looking at your cell phone as it will of course disrupt your night vision. So you can lie flat on your back, look straight up, taking in as much sky as possible that way and you should soon start to see the Gemini meteors. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece in Capota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.